Okay, y'all. I should have said something earlier, but y'all, this issue. I done had a problem with Circle K that made me like, I don't even fucking wanna go back over there for a while because I'm gonna speak with my dollars. Like, lovely T say, speak with your dollars. I'm gonna take her advice and listen to it. If you don't like something, don't try to, don't go with the council culture and all that shit. Just speak with your money. So, basically, put your money where your mouth is. So, that's me. And my way of putting it, what lovely T said, into my own words. So, like I say, I'm just not going to go, or I'm going to try my best to not go over there. As far as, unless my mama want to go over there, other than that, I'm not. I can't tell somebody else or the next person how to spend their money and where to go to. I can suggest it, but I did not know this Circle K which is a corner store, had, when did they start having their employees following you around? The inside of the store. And like I say, y'all, ever since this virus and fucking started, you know, people are just getting all kinds of fucking crazy. Like, people's minds is just gone. Like, like I tell you, people mind is just all over the fucking place. You got Karen, the Karen group of Karens that's acting fucking bonkers. Then you got the fucking pro people that's attacking people who was protesting. Everybody has a right, last time I checked, to freedom of speech. To peacefully protest. Notice I said peacefully. Without being harmed or have their life threatened or taken. But see, with this whole Circle K situation, uh, since when did Circle K start having people, their employees, following other people around? Even when this virus shit started, they didn't have nobody following you around because they know you have to come in there with a mask on. Now they're just following motherfuckers around. Like I'm in the store. You know how you walk around the store and start looking, trying to see what I want. Or if I want anything else on top of what I came for. So I'm to make sure I got everything before I just leave and have to go back. So, you got the employee, she come out the bill section. When I'm on one aisle here, just say, I'm on this aisle. She goes to this aisle in front of me. And then when I leave that aisle, to so go around it to see what's on it, to the candy aisle, which is on the other side. She goes around and stands at the corner where I can see at the corner of both aisles, like right there. And then when I go to check out, she walks right in front of me and stops on the side of me. Or she stand, first she starts, she stands on the corner while I'm checking out. And then trying to make it, the one I look at, she's trying to make it look like she trying to make sure everything's set up. She didn't drop stuff several times. That's how you know she ain't trying to uh, fix the shelves and fix the stuff that's on the shelf. She trying to make sure you ain't stealing nothing. I ain't never seen somebody go in that store with a purse and get followed around with get followed around by an employee. One of the employees that worked there. And this was an older black lady. That's why I say there's good and there's bad in every race. Not just, ain't no one race worse than or better than the next. And I'm gonna leave that at that. But like I said, y'all, do not go to the Circle K on Little Yard. It's up to you if you do, but I know for me, my money won't be getting spent there. Not if I can fucking help it. But what I'm gonna do is go to the corner stores, go to Family Dollar. If I gotta go to the Circle K while I'm out and about. I'm going to just drive further out to the Circle K that's the furthest out. Like the one I get my stamps at by my mama's doctor's office. This one over here is like... And then you go in there, normally they'll have change. So if you go in there with a 10, a 5, a 20 or whatever, they can give you the change. Now they're like, oh, well, you got to have exact change. 
Is it because of my fucking mask? Cause I like the Cowboys. Damn, I didn't know if that's the case. I didn't know football teams make people act like that. It make people hate you. Make people want to kill you. My God, damn! I know people kill each other over anything, but damn. Well, y'all, like I say, I'm finna speak my dollars. I'm gonna just go to any other store except for that store, okay? Cause that shit was just that was out of line today and uncalled for. But yeah, bye, y'all.